Welcome to Focus Garage. Today we're going to talk about the underbelly, under tray on this Focus SC or the Focus RS or if you have a regular Focus as well. Uh, you guys know if you live in a colder climate where it snows and uh, rains all the time and there's like salt on the road and that tray gets really uh, saggy and then it rips off or like it's easy to rip it off. It's, it's very flimsy and you have to take it off to get it, uh, oil change and all that stuff. There are other options out there after market, such as like, uh, a met aluminum ones where they're like, I, I believe they're like three to four hundred dollars. It's pretty expensive and you still have to take your tray to do your oil change. But there is a cheaper solution and you don't have to do anything. You can take the oil filter and uh, do your oil change without removing your tray and this is a Ford solution it's an OEM solution uh, I will put the part numbers down where you can find these but they come in uh, the Ford C-Max and electric Ford Focuses so and they fit on Focus SDs, Focus RS and also regular Focuses I'll show you guys what I'm talking about it's it's a very thick plastic it's very uh, sturdy and it's not going to get saggy. It's not, um, it's not going to rip off and it's pretty durable. I mean, let's be honest, 90% of people that owns it, they're not going to rally it. And even if you're rallying it, you're not really going over uh, big rocks that will like rip this plastic off. They're just, you know, uh, little rocks that are hitting on your underbelly. And this plastic is... Uh, sturdy enough to take that beating as well even if you're rallying I think so it's my opinion you can take it or leave it whatever you know if you still want to spend three hundred four hundred dollars go ahead be my guest but this I shipped to my house was fifty dollars I think it changes between fifty to hundred dollars depending on where you get it I got mine from eBay it was a junkyard whatever I got it from it it, it was Shipped to my house for $50 and I'm very happy about it. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about and I'll show you guys um, how to, I mean, after installation, I'll show you guys where the oil filter and oil, oil drain is where you don't have to take this off. So let's get to it. This is the tray. Uh, this is how would you would, how you would install it in your car. So this would be facing to the car and you can see right here where the oil drain is either this one or this one but oil drain comes out from these two location and your oil filter is right there and it's pretty sturdy plastic you can see it's pretty thick too so I mean it doesn't it doesn't really like bend or anything it's like pretty hard and you can just use your regular or you can use upgraded hardware to put this on but I assume regular would be fine because they don't change it between the C-Max or Focus so yeah so let's put it on and then I'll show you guys the end result and so it's kinda hard to see but here's the oil filter opening and I mean you have these opening right here and then here's your Oh, it's kind of dark. Let's get some air. Here's your uh, oil drain. Uh, my car is not leaking oil. I just changed oil, so it's just a uh, residue. And then you have all these openings right here. You know. And then, yeah, there you go. So, so this covers our uh, under tray upgrade. So the pros on this is. Uh, it's Ford OEM. You can get it for pretty cheap. Mine was $50 shipped, but I think you can get it brand new there, like $70 or $90 shipped to your house. So there's that option. So it's less than 100 bucks compared to 300 400 500 whatever you're going to spend on the metal ones. Uh, it's thick plastic, so it's it's stronger than the, the, uh, the one that comes in your car, and it's slightly less stronger than the metal one, but 90% of the time, this is going to be good enough for what you need on the as an under tray. Uh, the third uh, good thing is uh, 
it has an oil filter and oil drain right there so you don't have to remove this to do your oil change so your oil oil change uh comes to like 20 minutes so you save like five or ten minutes depending on how long it will take you to remove like five or ten those uh torque bits so so there is that cons i will say it's a it's a little heavy so you might want to upgrade your um uh, hardware but i mean there, there are options out there. Uh, you can get the C Max one. So since this is a C Max, C Max, or you can get other stuff there, upgraded. So I don't see any con besides that. I mean, it's plastic, but it's stronger. So yeah. So this covers it. Uh, let us know what you guys think about it. Would you do it, or would you go for the metal one, or fuck it, don't even use it. Uh, just go naked i guess uh let us know and please like the video subscribe and share it and kudos to all